so far what we can do is we have uh, we can log in and we can see the user data we can select uh, to see contacts settings or chat and we can actually log out so so far so good however i want this uh, logout button to be just like these buttons right here and then i want to show you how to add a prompt here because we don't want someone to be logged out by mistake we have to ask them so that they confirm so i'll show you how to do that okay so to begin with we will load the index.php page because that's the one that has the logout button here so let's go this is where the logout button is so what we will do instead is duplicate one of these so that we can add it to these guys okay so label uh, logout that's what we're going to change it to so i'm going to copy all of this and simply write logout I will use a capital L here for the view itself so let me try that refresh and there we go but since it doesn't have an image uh, let's come back here to our images in the UI let's see if there's any icon that uh, that suits us but uh, doesn't seem like there's any icon we can use here so we'll leave it at that we'll update it later all right so log out and we can now remove this one however let's keep the ID I think let's keep the ID here because we already set a um, an event listener for that let me see if that doesn't change anything okay there we go so we already have an event listener for that so let me um, remove that part so that we have that one there okay pretty good let me try this there logout oops it goes directly to logout if i refresh okay I go back all right so you see this is a uh, security problem right there it's not telling us that uh, we are we are actually logged out so let me see what's happening here before we go any further and do some other things so let me come down to where it actually checks here I want to echo out the result I am getting to see if it correctly identifies that we are logged out So let me refresh oops I'm not even getting the data from there how come it's supposed to go and get user info data immediately so what's happening oh sorry I'm supposed to say alert not result my bad all right there we go so there's an error here going on unidentified index user id on line 8 in user info okay so since it's unidentified it's not even supposed to reach that far it was supposed to to be cut off right at the top here so let's see what's going on here first of all this is not set so we are coming into here and then we're checking if it's set data object and data type is login which it is not it's not logged in then we come through here hmm. so the logic here isn't uh, working to our advantage it's failing us so the login uh, data there is user info so this is true that the type is set and this is it's not equal to login which is true so it should pass through here 
so why isn't it passing through here instead so let me try and uh, okay we have to do it uh, a different way here so what I want to do is use the server here instead of uh, to check for the for the page okay so I'm going to check for PHP self instead I'm going to use if server uh, PHP self is not equal to login dot PHP let me try that refresh okay logged in false okay so it's working so that's much better so let me go back to the index page and remove that alert there so that if I go back this way and refresh the page I am redirected all right so security acquired okay so now let me put my password here and go back again I'm getting the undefined so why is that so let me undo here and see what other animals we have brought about let me inspect element okay let me go to the that's the login page right so let me go down here to the login page and go to the handle result put an alert there so that I see what result we are getting let me refresh okay logged in false so I'm still getting that so what I want to do is go to the API here and check what server PHP self actually is so let me tell it to echo that and then die because that's just what I want to see so let me try that again so it's saying my chat API dot PHP hmm. so that isn't very useful information because every time it's going to be API maybe it's simply better to simply use the data type which is login okay I think it's better to simply do it like this so data object data type so we're just checking to see if the data type is not equal to login let me try that okay so we get something else and identified variable on line 11 All right, now the variable is unidentified because we are doing it up here when the data is being created down here. So I think that's that has been our problem all along. So I'll co cut this part and immediately after the session, this is where I'll paste that kind of thing. So let's refresh this and do it again. And there we go so everything should be working just fine after this so I still need to check if this is set so we go back to the original if this is set and something like this so let me see if I still get good results all right that's very good okay so now let's go back to the login.php and remove the alert here pretty good all right then password and there we go so there we go now for the logout here I want to create a um, uh, where is this index.php so let's go up here uh, down here actually so here where we are logging out the user what I want to do is just show you how to create a prompt so we're going to say uh variable answer is equal to and then we say prompt actually confirm 
like this. So this will ask you to confirm. Are you sure you want to log out like this? So what will happen here is that a prompt will come up and it will ask you this question. And then the answer will be equal to true or false depending on the answer itself. So we're going to say if answer, which is equivalent to saying if answer is true, then let's log you out. So let's test this to see if it actually works. Let me refresh the page and hit log out. And you say, are you sure you want to log out? And when I cancel, nothing happens. Are you sure you want to log out? And I say, okay, and I'm logged out. All right, so that was a simple addition there, and I'll see you in the next video.